What's up, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use my Snapchat bot that I coded in Python. And basically, what this does is it keeps your keeps your Snapchat streaks by just sending with a bot using a bot that captures points on your screen to send them to people every day at 1 p.m. Today I said at 1 p.m. was a good time. Anyway, what you're gonna need for this is you're gonna need an emulator. So right now I'm using Nox Player because I like it better than BlueStacks it will emulate onto your pc instead of like you can also plug if you have an android phone you can plug it into there and that actually works pretty good with an android phone um you can also use team viewer i've seen and blue stacks but blue stacks is a little lag when you press this camera button over here so i like to use personally nox player that's what i like the most that's just what i use so yeah anyway let's get started if you've already downloaded the exe and Run the installer and install the app. You can just search up Snap on your computer. Should open. All right, let's give it a second. All right, press Enter and camera button. That, that's where we start. Let's just resize that a little bit, make it a little bit smaller. Resizing it sometimes helps it with running. So, all right, press Enter and over camera button. All right, here I have my finger. Enter, Enter over the camera button. Press Enter went over picture button. As you can see, it says cords captured. We'll click that again, and then Enter went over pick button. I I put the send to button as pick, but you can just do that. Enter. Uh, group button is this, then person button is me, my main account, and then send. You see over here is all the bulk points. So we have anchors, I, don't, I shouldn't have probably called it anchors, but all these anchors are all the points that we have, all the coordinates, and some of them are saved as different. There's six different coordinates, six, six different clicks. So you can go back here and it says go back to picture page and person. So let's test that out. As you can see, it has captured my mouse movements and it's moving and I promise you I'm not controlling it with my own hand. It, what it does is it emulates, it emulates the bot so that Snapchat doesn't catch you using a bot. Instead of doing regular clicks where it just like moves immediately there, it uses smooth mouse movement to fake, um, to fake out the app. So the app doesn't know that you're using a bot. And actually I've gotten banned three times, but finally after this version, you don't get banned from using it. I'm probably going to update it in the future, maybe make an API for it that you can use, make it all better. But for now, uh, this is it. And as you can see, it should say bot running at 1 p.m. If it says that, that means you're good. Um, if it doesn't say that, sometimes you can just zoom in. And it should be good if you just zoom in. But right now, it's just bot running at 1 p.m. So just keep everything where it is, because if you move it around a little bit, you know, it can get messed up. You can, like, hit it apart and it won't click the right thing and it won't work but i've tested it it does run at 1 p.m i've used schedule for it to run at 1 p.m um if you want to look through my code the github repository is a link first link in the description okay and you can also download it from there so you can just do code download zip and wait for it to download all right you see this is the installer right here i'll let it run then cancel it because i already have it installed see you know, it is, uh, I'm not installing it right now, though. Cancel. Yes, exit. And all the code is in here. So we have the README. I'll probably add the, yes, uh, the YouTube tutorial for into here. And he, this is redo.txt where they save all your mouse points so that it can use them later. And the script, which, which reruns it using against uh, schedule and pickle. It pickles all your things. And it uses schedule, you see. Schedule at run pending, and it says schedule every day at 1300 because it uses military time. And it's the main code. You see, it's not that much. I might do a tutorial on how I did it. But yeah, it's pretty easy, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you get a lot of your streaks to continue with this or make a lot of new ones. It's pretty good. I'll work on it more, but thanks for watching, guys.